I just wanted to do a quick video of the journal that I did tonight. I was inspired to do this after watching Dwayne's video on his purse journal. Um, I didn't think that size would quite work for me, but I used the 6x9 envelope. And I think this will work fine and it should fit in my purse. Um, so in here I just have some extra paper that I'll use in the journal. Uh, I'll library card in the front with a library card. A lot of this is um, the owl ephemera that I've been collecting and not using, so I decided it's time to use it. Um, these cards are from Michael's graph paper. This paper is from the dollar store. This notepad, is, or this is one of those um, magnetic notepads that goes on the fridge, also from Michael's. You know when they have those bins near the front and everything's pretty affordable? I can't remember what they cost, but... Um, this pattern paper is just from my stash. Um, sorry, this card just came out of this top of pocket here. Can't do it with my one hand. This card also from Michael's. A bag with some German cards in it. The idea is to have a journal small enough to fit into my purse so I'll actually use it. I just find that my bigger journals I'm really not getting around to using, so give this a try. My plan is to post a video after as well, after I use it. I made the center one into a pocket to hide the stitching. This again is just pattern paper that I folded over to make a pocket. In the center here, there's a top loading pocket. That's just the other side of my that notepad. My goal is to do one of these a month, so I tried to put approximately 30 pages or 30 writing spots in here, and then my intention is to do one per day. So we'll see how I do. In this back one here, my intention is to put some paper clips and some um, stickies and things like that, but I haven't done that yet. So that's it. It just um, closes with a ribbon. It's one signature. And I did the four whole pamphlet stitch. And uh, hopefully in a month, I'll be able to post the finished version. Thanks for watching.